Hey folks, Papa Boris here, playing some more Hades. I forgot to spend my darkness last run. I think I'm actually not gonna get the fifth reroll. We're just gonna start working on these rerolls because they're really expensive. And eventually, once I have enough of those, I'll switch and start using that one instead of the chamber rerolls. Okay, let's take a look at our next weapon. It is the bow again. All right, rolling a lot of bows lately. What was I last time? I was Chirine, time to be Ramalama Ding Dong. Now, uh, I could do this just to keep on leveling the Zeus Trinket, but with Rama, I actually really do like Dionysus quite a bit more, so I'm gonna take Dionysus again. What are we getting up to? Seven heat, ooh. Okay, let's go ahead and just grab one rank of tight deadline and three of extreme measures. Did I push the wrong button? Okay, there we go. And have a nice relaxing run. Just uh, walking around, pushing the special button, having a good life, having a good life. Now what I think I'm going to do with this playthrough is I'm going to work on getting this epilogue going. And once I hit the epilogue, then we're going to jump in heat. Special hangover, yay! This is, by the way, why you want the, the choice rerolls, so that if you have a run like this where you really need it, you can reroll this and make sure you get the special. But we got the rare special. Perfect. Plumed it, bruh! Wait, did it just... Yeah, I heard the ding. I'm gonna get this fish for like five gems. Sure am. I'm not like on a deadline or anything. Pretty significant fake out splashes on that one, but no, just a basic old hellfish. You're gonna die? Nice. All right. Oh, there's more. Hmm, okay, I'm gonna reroll that. You know me, I don't love my coins. Oh god, I love this bow. This is just like such a good hidden aspect. It's just like, hey, are you tired of like working hard when you play with a bow? Well, how about a one-way tri- Okay, uh, I'm gonna do this. I need to get one of these. The bow, the Rama is like the best weapon you could possibly have for doing it. And I actually wouldn't mind an upgraded rarity Aphrodite. We could get a bunch of good stuff like, um... You just gotta make sure that you avoid the things that come at you or shoot projectiles. We're pretty lucky here. We just got the Fados and the Lugs. The Lugs are incredibly easy to avoid. Fados, they do charge at you. Just make sure you don't overcommit pushing the button. And there we go. An easy as Goblin Pie, Rarity Enhanced Aphrodite. Okay, attack, call. And then, hmm. Oh, I do love this early in the run, but I think I'm gonna win without it. So we're just gonna take the call. And get a nice big beefy attack against bosses. I have to say, you know, I was I used to be just completely obsessed with Aphrodite's call. That was like back when in the early days of my career playing Hades. Career. God. Just cause you make YouTube videos, Boris, doesn't mean that sitting around in your basement playing video games is a career. Okay. Back in my early days when I was just playing Hades years ago, for my own self. And who are we kidding? I'm still playing for my own self. But anyway, uh, then I, when I had a really hard time winning, I really leaned on Aphrodite's call and something like Hermes' God o, uh, auto god gauge gain. Oh, yuck. Well, not anything to do with the special. We'll just take that, I guess, because it seems like it doesn't affect anything. I don't, I don't want anything that's going to make the attack slower or worse or whatever. Not that I care, because I don't ever use the attack. Anyway, back when I had a hard time winning the game, I really needed like the Aphrodite call and some God Gauge modification to win. Or at least it felt like a lot of my successful runs just used that 2500 damage. 
I'm not sure why I'm looking here. I'm pretty sure I wouldn't get anything. No, that's not true. I would have taken a Chaos Gate. I would have spawned a Chaos Gate. I might have missed a Chaos Gate for all I know. I haven't really particularly been looking carefully around all the rooms. La -de da Doodle day. Could I have gone for seven minute time deadline? Mm, yes, but the numbers wouldn't have worked out because that would have been three heat. I would have needed four more and you can't get four from extreme measures. That's a relief. And I'm still not feeling confident about five. Oh God. Oh God. Okay, I'm trying to get a cast in him. That might not have been worth it. Problem, this is just really the, oh wait, what am I doing? Hold on. This is stupid, I should've done this right away. So, it has a lot of armor, and the hangover knocks off when it goes into hiding. So I, uh, I biffed it by not just using Meg right away. Attack Doom, Cast Drift. Okay, we're gonna take the Cast Drift. It does mean I can't put a cast in enemies, but that's fine. I don't care about that with Rama, and the other great thing about it is that I can get some legendary cast-based boons. Okay, what is our bonus here? Cast? Oh. Cast damage bonus. Oh, lord. Well, hey, I mean, we do have a risk coming out, so I guess 9% more bonus damage on that is not nothing, but... I would prefer just some regular old damage bonus, to be completely honest with you. I think he'll go all the way this time, Boldy. That kind of makes it sound like I don't normally. I'm a little bit offended, Sisyphus. I'm about to break you free from your eternal punishment in hell, and you doubt me like this? You know, it says you believe in Boldy, and Boldy believes in you, but I don't think Sisyphus believes in me. <laughs> Very offended. Oh, there's another one over there? Come in handy. Oh, come on. Auto-aim. I'm trying to get this one. Is that an, oh, it's another... It's another gate. Oh, man. Well, it depends on what it is. I might actually go down there. I did get a very easy set of enemies for that gate, but with the distant nature of the bow. Like, I've been hit exactly once this whole time. I got hit by a single skull, you know, so this is the time to do it. Uh, okay, well, actually, this is a really tough choice because I haven't upgraded my special yet. But I gotta get the trial room, right? I mean, two boons, that's really solid. And we'll get palms, you know, we'll, we'll get them. We'll get, look at this, already paying off with best boon in the game, fountain, whoop, whoop. Oh, we have a trove here and a shop. Don't know, okay, no, shop, I, I will look in the shop. I, there's not much that I would buy, but I would buy a chaos gate. Not because it's that amazing or anything, but just for funsies, Mr. Bunsies. And the trove, if it's not gems, I'll take that too. Dash, slash, okay, so this is not that good, but I'll take this. You know, every every little bit helping, I suppose. Healing, random, undamaged, okay. I'm not gonna do it for eight health. We'll just grab a palm here to make up for the two palms that we missed not going into the Erebus gate, and yay, I got my special up from six to eight. That first palm, so juicy. If I had taken the two palm, it would have just taken it up to nine. It's not like a huge deal or anything. Oh, we got a Lecto. Oh, boy. Hey, you know, that, you know, that wasn't a bad, that wasn't bad. That was not a bad chunk of damage. I mean, I don't think that's like super great end game damage by any means, but that wasn't bad. I don't think it was because of uh, Boldy's 9% or anything, but. Wait, does she get hurt by her own thingies? By those spikes? I thought she'd be immune to the spikes. Awfully dark in here. God, do you just have like bad eyesight? You're gonna be squinting all the time. Okay, auto aim is really wrecking me here. I didn't care about Fatso back there. 
And the fact that I'm Aphrodite instead of some other god's god power means I don't really get much benefit out of using it before it fills up, but it's fine. There we go. So that was six minutes, which means that I could have had it on seven minutes and been fine, but I would not have been fine if I had been on five minutes. Hmm, 5% damage boost. Let's grab the Palm Blossom. I could take also the Coin Purse. Call, cast, fountain, okay. Chaos Gate? Okay, I'm gonna do this. I always don't do this, and then I regret that I didn't do it, especially since I spent one in the first act. Let's just get it. And if I waste it at the end, I waste it at the end. But now that we can use them against Hades, I'm less likely to use them at the end. I mean, heck, you, you want two in Act 4, right? One for the mini boss, one for Hades. If you end up fighting both mini bosses, then you want three. That at least leaves me with two to spare. You know, any old, and I, and I, you almost always end up using it against uh, the Act Three boss. That just leaves me with one. Yeah, I think I'm gonna use them all. I'm, I'm gonna call it here. We made it. Nearly made it. But will he go all the way, Baldy? What do you think, Baldy? I'm thinking this time, nah. Message for you, Lord Hermes. Hey, the bond has finally been forged. Oh boy! If I, I would actually take special attack faster over side hustle, but uh, if it's only attack faster, we're grabbing that side hustle. Hmm, sweet, sweet coins. Oh, this is good. To be honest, not a lot of great targets for the upgrade on this. Okay, there's a Chaos Gate. Let's try to remember that. Even though it may mean I fight the boss with the curse. This is a very good weapon to fight the boss with. So, I'm not super scared. Especially since I got the rare upgrade to the bow special. I mean, we're barely taking any damage. Okay, I did just sit, stand, stand there and take a very slow moving projectile to the face as I was uttering the sentence, but generally speaking in this run, it is true to say that we are barely taking any damage. I'll just fire that at somebody. It'll do what it does and it won't do what it doesn't do and then that's fine. Harp. Aphrodite's aid does not buff the damage but it increases the charm duration, so, you know, it's something when using it on normal enemies, which I will be doing more probably in Act 3. Lots more annoying, long-lived enemies you want to charm there. Special more damage, more health, more coins. Hmm, that's an interesting one. I think 58% more damage on the special, it, it actually matters, you know. Uh, you know, here, I would value... Aries more, but I don't have a Zeus yet, so we'll take that for the 5% damage bonus. Okay, we're just gonna do this. Do I need to do this? No. Do I need to stand still and get hit by five rocks? Yes. Also, that I could send my cast into a rock that doesn't actually damage the enemy? You got it. You know how I roll. Now, this one does not clear the hangover when jumping up in the sky. I, I wonder if doing that just makes it sit in place. Ah, that was a pretty cool use of it. That was pretty cool. There goes the power cup. You can hear me, my chair. Attack, dash, call. I just feel like I don't I don't wanna I don't want the cognitive load of thinking about this, so we'll just take that. It's not the best. Oh, that's actually not, that doesn't count as your dash, right? That, that's not the do lightning damage when you dash. That's do lightning damage if you dash out of damage. Okay, so my dash slot is open, which I guess is both a good thing and a bad thing. I'm not sure I'd really want a dash upgrade or care about it that much. Oh, those Draconids get wrecked by my attack. Or my special, technically. Ah, you know, oh, those casts, those those rifts. I don't. I haven't played with them in ages. Totally not bad. Totally not bad. 
drunk and flourish no kidding oh yes palm blossom got the one that i wanted attack dash nectar okay i'm not taking this for the nectar i'm taking it for the health but we got another drunken flourish oh well that makes me feel good about not going into the uh erebus gate health healing okay we'll just leave it save the coins grab the health All right, what am I missing here, guys? Oh, look at those, look at those lightning before getting hit. Oh, man. Your palm's starting to sweat from watching these pro gamer moves? Post a comment telling me about how sweaty your palms are. Is that, is that how you get engagement on YouTube? Post a comment and tell me how your bowels are roiling. If you feel like you're about to have an aneurysm, post in the comments below. All right, mid shop, palm. Well, we got the special upgraded to four, so nothing else matters enough. If I had a god power that I cared about upgrading, I would, but Aphrodite's is just, there's my first attack of the run. Aphrodite's is just charm duration, so that's pretty much it. Just cruising along, singing a song. Okay, I'm not gonna use my cast on this because I don't wanna have to hunt down my casts. Like, yes, it would do really good damage, but what I wanna do is use the casts to help quickly bring down some of these heads, Ooh, especially since those two are next to each other. And now that that's happened... Ah. We can get out of there. Let's pick up the cast, and I'm gonna do the same strategy. I'm just gonna hunt my cast down. I got all three, but I'm not actually gonna use them. Where am I using my god power, you ask? Uh, I think I'm just gonna kill one head with it, basically. And I'm not gonna use my chthonic companion. We'll need him. Learning my lessons, we are gonna need him. Harp, harp, harp. Actually, I don't think I'm gonna get my god gauge up to the damage point. Oh, I am. Hold on. You die. Borp. Have fun dying. Oh, man. That was such a good taunt. They should use that in an action movie. Where, like, the bad guy does a monologue and the bad guy thinks he's gonna win. Oh, I missed. And then the good guy's like, actually, have fun dying. Boom. And then the bad guy dies. God, if this YouTube thing doesn't work out, I gotta write screenplays in Hollywood. Oh, I'm in a thing. Hey, but it died right before it mattered. Whoop, whoop. Okay, so I'm still on pace where I could have played with seven minutes, but not with five for the deadline. Good to know, good to know. Fountain. Oh, that feels good. Keep the pump. Am I gonna? No, you know, I, no I'm not gonna keep the pump. Not gonna do it. I'm gonna just take some coins. I'm gonna really flex here. Yeah. I'm gonna take the coins. I would normally take the Myrmidon Bracer for damage resistance, but I don't need it. I don't think I need it with this build. And by this build, I mean I picked that one bow aspect and I got that one special upgrade. Yeah, that build, I don't think I need anything to survive Act 3. I also have a lot of health because. I got the nectar and I guess a higher than average number of healths. Healths, yep, that's the word. Healths, not hearts, healths. Okay, should get my god gauge soon and I am going to use it when this next big of enemy spawns. Ready, herp. All right, now go fight that chariot over there for me. Go fight the chariot. You're not listening. Oh, you're also, not, you're also not charmed anymore. For some reason, I thought seven seconds was synonymous with infinity. Power shot attack, attack. Oh, God, okay. Oh, that was a bunch of nothing. Like, li those upgrades do literally nothing. I, I should have, like, literally not even taken hammers. Have I gotten all the bow upgrades? I should really check and see. 
um, whether I've gotten all the all the hammers for which weapons. You know, hmm. Probably shouldn't have taken the coin purse because I have side hustle. Hundred coins is less valuable here than it might normally be. And of course, they open Boris, and you can flex in Act Four, and that's true. But I, I just hate playing for the flex because it might be a diamond, and at this point, diamonds are completely—I just mean completely useless. God Gage charges automatically. Oh, yeah, that's the good stuff. Okay, that does nothing. Oh man, shop or try. You know what? I'm gonna be lazy. This right here. Oh, I didn't check the shop down there. Uh, this is just the epitome of laziness. I, I went here not because it's the correct choice, but just because... Where, where the hell's the damn fish? Well, that is... Uh, that is the most camouflaged fish ever. That fish was a green beret. Don't sleep at night, because if you do, you are not going to hear that fish coming to slit your throat. All right, palm, dark. Okay, we'll take the darkness. I'm not gonna buy because I don't need it. Yeah, I guess we're flexing today. Hope it's the butterfly ball. It is, get nice and close. Do the Chthonic Companion. Make sure you don't forget to get the heads. If I charm you, head, will you stop regenerating? Oh man, that, that might have actually worked. Bingo, bada dingo. Attack, resist. Okay, we'll take the resistance of damage. It is tempting, of course, to take the attack to use up the slot, but I think the damage resistance is more useful than the, the average thing that I might get in place of an attack buff. Okay, I got the god gauge. Now that it charges automatically, I might be able to save up. But I'm not going to mess around with it. We'll just do that. Also, that was pretty stupid because there's no other enemies here. I mean, it's still useful because it's not attacking me. But I could have also handled it even if it were. It, uh, the charm ran out right before it died. And it managed to get one in me. It managed to get one in me. Oh, man. That was embarrassing. Okay. This shieldo just shielded everybody. Ex except did it not shield the one that I had charmed? If so, that's pretty cool. Charm somebody. I know there's a floating head over there. Can you attack the floating head for me? No, you're not going to. Thanks for nothing. Doodly doodly. Uh -huh. Okay. Coins are... You know what? Neither. Not sure Aphrodite is anything I care about, but I'm pretty sure I don't need coins or palms. Yeah, so I didn't go to that trial room just because I didn't want to spend the literal time to, to, to do it. I went to the shop to have no encounter instead of having the trial room, which would have been a rather lengthy encounter. Don't mind me just ignoring a recharging head to go get an urn that A, I don't actually need, and B, I could have easily gotten later after the encounter. Oh, the trap missed. Burp! Maybe the butterfly ball being charmed will make the enemies go after it? God, every time I charm an enemy, I really do act like, and now that enemy is on my side forever. I'm going to invite it to my birthday party. Charm has an infinite duration, is what my brain says, anytime I finally think of using my god power. Ah! Whoa, 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 all that? Oh, there's pinwheels here. Oh, there's more enemies spawning? The hell on a hex gate is going on here. You just stay right there, bitch. All right. Dash. Revenge. Revenge. Coins. Ag again? Coins or pops? Come on. What, 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 what is, what's, what's going on here? Okay, not sure that I'm getting much out of Aphrodite. This this might be literally less useful than coins or palms. Like, if I had taken coins, you know, I would have made it more likely I could get the flex and still buy some other things. I think I'm still going to get the flex no matter what just because of side hustle and all those little tunnel rooms. 
harp. Hey, it actually killed it actually killed the shieldo for me. That's nice. Harp! Ooh, shieldos. You can shoot your stuff at other people. I'm fine with it. Bit of a beefy room here. Oh man, it really got the head. That was like a sniper shot down a ravine. Passing by an army of enemies on either side to hit the head. Attack nearby. Okay, this is this is where I'm just taking it to get rid of the slot. Okay, we've had enough Aphrodite. That's that's more Aphrodite than we needed. Let's move on. I would have loved some more Ares boon since I have a rift. Try to get some of those rift oriented legendaries or duos, but alas, get nothing but Aphrodite today. I have no idea what the status is, by the way, with my legend duos and legendaries. No idea what kind of stuff I need. I should do probably an off camera inventory on that. Chariot? I don't like you. Why are you coming at me? What? Are, <laughs> okay, I get that you're my friend, but that was still kind of menacing. Do you understand? Big chariot like you. People are going to wonder, how many butterfly balls are here? This is just what happens, I guess, when you ignore the butterfly balls. Holy moly. Oh my god. The ninja! Taking on the ninja class of 2023 over down in Hades land. Sure, I'll take that. That was crazy. Uh, you could not see that butterfly ball. And then there was that fish earlier. Not gonna buy it, because it just doesn't matter. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. These two bitches. Well, I'm really, I'm, I'm excited. I am ready to hit these guys with my automatically God Gauge gaining Aphrodite. Oh, 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 come on. How? How? Just how? Okay, I'm ready for it. Are you ready for it? Down, down, down. Hey, Theseus, do you mind? Could you please just go in a circle around the arena? What the hell's your problem, man? Okay, so I've got my God Gauge. What I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna pop Theseus with it because the Minotaur is about to have his, about to have his uh, shield popped. I just took 50, so I didn't want to waste the damage on it. Oh my, oh my God! I'm gonna lose a Death Defiance here. This is crazy. Oh God, took a 50, took a couple of 30s. I mean, I'm really 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 leaning on the uh the uh, just mountain of health i have 300 health going into this fight is it's a lot i don't even i don't was it really just was it really just no it can't just be just the dionysus and nectar thing okay that was close can you please just die please just die please please could you could you please die thank you Goodness, I really needed you to die. All right, well, we're, we're gonna make it. Like, like just to, to put it in perspective, if I had, you know, 200 health, I would be dead. If I had 225 health, I would be dead. And 225 health is a health I am usually pretty happy to have at this part of the proceedings. So I needed, I really needed just this absurd amount of health I have for some reason to not die because I played so badly. All right, we are gonna have to be a little bit careful because that didn't quite kill him. Didn't quite kill the old bastard. Whew. And then we get to fountain up and heal everything. So getting away with incompetence is the name of this run. Or I don't know, maybe it'll be about the ninjas. Yeah, I think the ninjas are better. 
Maybe more people will click on the one about the ninjas. I'm gonna take the Mermit on Brazer because apparently today I need it. Diddly do, diddly do. Caught it, I say. Gotta get those coins. Uh, yeah, all those coins I re-rolled and didn't take are making it a little bit uncertain. I get this flex. Okay, it's a diamond, so it doesn't matter. I am gonna go and start spending stuff. I'm gonna do this, actually, because my things are completely useless, so I might as well. Explosive shot and sniper shot. Those sound like things that are not... Mm-hmm, 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 not upgrading my special. Let us also grab some hell, uh, palm. Attack, special, and call. Well, we'll take this. That that actually is, I mean, I have a bunch of dumbass boons, so the fact that I still rolled my special is great. And sure, we'll take an Ares. Dash, Death Defiance, wider area. Let's take the dash, why not? That'll be good for the rats. And then we just gotta save up another 349 coins to get that other one may or may not be possible depending on how many tunnels I go through here with my side hustle and how many urns I get okay I gotta try to avoid the satyr oh that that satyr really looked like it got me Oh, there was an urn. That urn was hiding behind another urn. Yeah, this is definitely the run of the ninja. Taking on Hades ninjas here. The ninja fish, the ninja butterfly ball, and the ninja urn. I have never seen anything like it. I've never seen like any one of those things, honestly. I've never seen the urn hiding behind the urn. I've never seen a fish that was that hard to see. And that butterfly. I've, yeah, that's like three things in all my hours of this game I've never seen anything like. All in one run. All right, gotta remember to do this, especially because it is like the worst one. <gasps> he dodged. This, by the way, is why I like the Achilles. <coughs> the Achilles. Chthonic Companion. Because that one doesn't miss. Nobody can dodge out of the way. Now that one, if there are multiple enemies, you don't always hit the same one twice. In fact, you won't, but... Um, hmm, God Gage charges up. We'll just get charged up even faster. Yeah, against Hades, the faster I get it, the better, right? So, we'll just do it. I was tempted by the jolting, because my I have, I have this dash doing damage, you know, so the jolting would have been something. I am actually just going to reroll this other one that's a mini boss. Ares, perfect. All right, let's see if we can get a boonie. Oh, no. Oh, no. Come on. What, he changed direction? You can't do that. That's not, that's not nice. Your satyr mom taught you to be better than that. Come on. Okay, I don't have anywhere to go here. What, what am I supposed to do? What am I supposed to do, he says, facing a threat he's faced, you know, tens if not hundreds of times in his life could have dodged across the gap and not taken a rat claw to the face but i thought you know what no let's stand there and build character today let's build some character oh, here we go explosive shot boom oh such a useful such a useful such a useful thing on this weapon i just love being able to slowly do no damage okay this is a good room just a couple of little Roombas. Oh, the little, little claw urn there. I got lucky with a two sack. Does mean I was not going to get that rarity enhanced Ares, which means what I should have done is bought it instead of buying the regular one. Hmm, bind rift longer, pull foes in, or just damage in a bigger area. Let's have them last longer. I mean, if they pull enemies in, that's kind of like having a wider area. I, I, uh, I could dick around and do another tunnel just to get that other Ares and then because it's rarity enhanced have maybe a higher than average chance of getting a duo or a legendary based on rifts but you know what I could also just go fight Hades and take rifts some other time because I mean whatever I'll take rifts sure and it's not like this is the once in a lifetime 
time that I'm going to be taking rifts. Especially because I like Ares' call, so I'll be taking rifts all day long, man. I just haven't been offered that one in a while. I miss it. Ooh, got a fish here. Oh, he actually talks about it when there's a fish there? That's pretty cool. Oh, he doesn't start with an invisible. The actual ninja being less of a ninja than an urn, a butterfly, and a fish. Now, I will be using this, the Chthonic Companion. We're going to use it in the second phase when there are times that he is still. Got to use those 9% damage enhanced casts in order to take some more damage from the boss. Ah! Okay, hopefully I get my god gauge. There it is, this is what I wanted. I need to get it right after he turns invisible. That's always a little tricky, of course, because there's other enemies and you don't want those to get hit. And he also can go invisible right away. What I'm gonna do here is just work on the adds and take like 15 damage from that one slowly expanding Nova ring by repeatedly dashing into it. Oh yeah, oh yeah, look at that damage. Rifties, where are my Rifties at? That's pretty cool. Is it really getting sucked in? I, I like the sucking in thing. That's great. Okay, I'm just gonna pop this. Nice. And then now uh, is when I'll use Meg. So I'm going to wait for him to do his fire attack. Unlike with the God Gauge, it doesn't really matter when you use your Chthonic Companion because you only get one use, so you might as well wait for a good time. Now, you might have been like, well, Boris, why not use it there where he was standing still? I know, it's just I don't trust anything anymore. After I missed that satyr, I just trust nothing. Can you please shoot your fire attack? Shoot your fire attack. Come on. The irony is I probably could have hit him like 15,000 times by now. Okay. Uh, he's going to... Mm, he's going to go to the second phase sooner. I would have used it there. Okay, there he is. There it is. And we're going to also pop him with this. <laughs> oh, dog, that was a lot. Oh, man. Oh, I've been forgetting to use my casts. Oh, can we can we get the flex of killing him without dying? 9 health out of 330. <laughs> So I clearly would have used a Death Defiance or two if I just hadn't picked up an astronomical amount of health that time. So that was Beefcake versus the Ninjas on that one. All right. Thanks for watching, everybody. Hope you enjoyed it. Please like and or subscribe. Could have made it with seven. Could not have made it with five. Not even close to making it with five. Trouty. Trizzy Trout. Thanks for watching, guys. Uh, this is it. But if you want to stick around for the blabber dabber at the end, feel free. Somebody, give me a voice acting job, please. I can do really good death throws. All right, I'll throw Nectar away. I'm literally never going to get the bond with Hypno, so this does absolutely nothing, but but that's fine. Take some Ambrosia, Mom. Let's get drunk together. Come on, Cerberus. Forge a bond with me, buddy. No. I'm afraid to do it off camera because I'm worried that like I'm one away and then uh, I get it off camera and then, you know, not that it matters, not that anybody cares, but okay. Please give me Achilles. Oh, thank God. Thank God it's Achilles. 
Oh, thank God. I did not want to get Sisyphus. No offense, Sisyphus. I'll free you, but I really want Achilles' companion. I am so tired of missing with things I should not miss. Okay, this is the last really relevant use for diamonds. But we have 30 of them, so we're fine, and we freed Achilles. Unfortunately, he's not here. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. So, unfortunately, I don't. I still don't get it right now, but hopefully he will be around next time to give it to me. Hey, darkness, definitely. Every little bit helps. We've got a lot of fish that run. One, two, three, four. Just four. Okay, not super crazy. Next run, the fists. And I guess we're back to the normal fists. Thanks for watching, everybody. Hope you enjoyed it. Please like and or subscribe. I'll see you again soon. Take care.